I am Karin Strand. And I am Tuna Morgan. We are expedition leaders at Hertha Group. Today, we're going to talk about a subject that is very important to us, sustainability. Yes, but instead of just stating that this is important for us, we are also going to tell you about what we have accomplished with Hurtsarutten's commitment to sustainability so far. It's an ongoing work that we are super proud of, so we might get a bit over enthusiastic. Yes, we might, but let's try to do this without sounding too self-important. So where do we start? How about a short, understandable explanation about what is sustainability? Good idea. Well, the simplest explanation of sustainability that I know of is the focus on meeting the needs for the present without compromising the ability of future generations to meet their needs. Sustainability is measured in three different pillars, one economic, one environmental, and one social. And they all count. You can't just choose one of them and be done with it. Maybe an even easier explanation is that sustainability is contributing to planet, people, and profit without doing damage. Well said. Might I add that in Hurtsrutten, we think that building knowledge is a lot about the people and the environment, and we train our crew, but more importantly, we do create an environmental ambassadors amongst our guests. Our guests are very interested in learning more about how to protect the environment and sustain the local communities they are visiting with us. On every voyage, you can participate in lectures to learn more about topics ranging from climate change and ocean plastic to eco-efficiency measures you can take on board and when you return home. As a guest, you can also make significant contributions to climate and environmental science by getting involved in our citizen science projects. That's right. And being a cruise operator, we know that we have a big job to do. And our goal is to stay in the forefront and in our industry. We know that every voyage we take leaves a certain footprint. But the fact that we acknowledge that is crucial for our commitment. It might seem strange, but fight against mass tourism by supporting stricter regulations in pristine destinations includes limits on ships and shore visits. We put great effort into enhancing our destinations, strengthen our environmental initiatives, and at the same time, run a responsible and sustainable operation. But I think of, we are kind of sidetracked now, Karen. Let's get back to sustainability and how it all started. Absolutely. The word sustainability was first used in an English book called Blueprint for Survival in 1972. Then in 1987, the concept got a bit more known when several countries wrote the Brundtland Report, known as our common future for the United Nations. This evolved into what today is known as UN Sustainability Development Goals. And we use these 17 goals as our framework. One of these UN goals is caring about life below the water and plastic in the oceans is one of the biggest challenges in our world today. With this in mind, we were the first cruise line to ban single-use plastic throughout our entire operation in 2018. That means you won't find items like plastic cups, straws or cutlery on board our ships. In addition, we worked with our suppliers to find suitable alternatives to packaging for foods, goods and merchandise. By doing this, we reduced more than 32 tonnes of single-use plastic every year. As a guest, you can contribute too. On most of our expeditions, you can participate in beach cleanups and other activities. Every year, our guests pick up 10 folds of tons of litter in pristine areas in the world that we bring back for recycling. But plastic in the oceans are not only large items like fishnets, bottles and bags. One of the key sources of ocean pollution is microplastic. And this is found in all oceans now. Our guests were shocked to find microplastic in Antarctica when doing citizen science projects here. So as a part of our commitment to reducing plastic waste, we have taken a proactive stand and stopped selling fleece clothing because fleece is one of many sources of microplastic. 
In addition, we use washing nets for laundry to reduce our impact on the environment from microplastics and microfibers. We also sell these washing nets to our guests on some of our ships. For foodies, sustainability means good news. We offer full menus of vegan and vegetarian meals and a range of new and exciting plant-based alternatives. We've done this in order to reduce CO2 intensity in our operations, as well as to promote healthier food and living. And we prove that it can taste good. We serve food made by local producers along the entire Norwegian coast. And wherever possible on our expeditions, for you, this means you can enjoy meals from fresh and locally produced seafood, meat, dairy, condiments, vegetables, and more that are loaded directly on board our ships. This significantly reduces food miles and optimizes the use of port facilities. These ingredients come from small scale farms and suppliers that share our passion for good food. We have also implemented food management waste programs on all ships during the last years, aiming to reduce food waste by 30% over the next two years. When it comes to people part of sustainability, we are dedicated to be supporting the local communities we visit and to be creating positive impact on the places we visit as well. By trading locally and sourcing services such as food and excursions from local suppliers, we contribute to the livelihood and welfare of these people. In return, they welcome our guests. So for you, this means when going on an excursion, you will have authentic experiences offered by locals who really know the area. We have two new hybrid powered expedition ships, MS Roald Amundsen and MS Fritjof Nansen. They have battery packs installed and a cutting edge hull design that reduce carbon emissions with more than 20% compared to other cruise ships of the same size. When it comes to fuel, we banned heavy fuel oil in all our ships a decade ago, and we are currently advocating for a worldwide ban. We have started using shore-based power in Bergen, Norway. Shore power eliminates air pollution and is a significant contributor to green stays in port. This basically improves the local air quality a lot, and it's a lot less noisy. By doing this, each of our vessels reduce CO2 emissions by 130 metric tons a year. The annual NOx reduction per ship is estimated to two and a half tons compared to burning fossil fuel during port stays. We will continue to work for shore-based power facilities at key ports along the Norwegian coast. You can also contribute via the Hertegruten Foundation. We started this foundation to ensure that our guests of tomorrow can enjoy the same unique experiences as our guests of today. Funds that support local initiatives that either help people or nature are raised through a number of initiatives, including auctions on board, direct contributions from guests, as well as contributions we make from Green Stay Nights. The Green Stay is an option for our guests where you simply hang a tag on your door. This means you'll use the same towel and bed sheets as the night before. This has a direct positive impact on energy, water and the use of detergent. For each Green Stay night, we contribute five Norwegian kroner to the Hertegruten Foundation. Cooperating is important when working with sustainability and we really encourage cooperation throughout the travel industry for a greener future. We have been actively involved in establishing the Association of Arctic Expedition Cruise Operators for Arctic Issues. Through the International Association of Antarctic Tour Operators, we work to secure environmentally sustainable tourism in both regions, Arctic and Antarctic. To sum it all up, whether we are exploring the Norwegian coast, Antarctica, Greenland, Alaska, Spitsberg and the Americas, the Caribbean or other destinations off the beaten track, we take pride in leaving a small footprint. We will continue working on our commitment to sustainability, while at the same time creating lifelong memories for you. So when you explore with us, you are setting a new, more sustainable standard for adventure travel.